three three fights and just back to back just in the gym you know and this is my fourth fight mm -hmm. uh this year and i feel great yeah um how do you feel about this this uh new move that you guys did you got your own training now your own gym it's it's, it's more like uh you know, more personal, the training yeah. more. No, more. yeah, it's, it's a personal facility that Andy uh, got, and for him and, and his fighters as well, and I, we, we, we all appreciate that, you know, and we've been in here just putting in work day in, day out. Yeah, how's, no excuse. How's Andy looking in this training? Man, camp? he's looking sharp, he's looking focused, he's he's, he's ready for this fight. He's gonna, you guys gonna see a, 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 a good, a good fucking focused, well trained Andy. Yeah, um, getting past Ortiz, obviously, um, what do you think is the, is the big picture for Andy? Man, just getting back to the shot, title, title, um, the belts, you know, that that's his main goal. Just, yeah. But uh, Ortiz, is he's in the way, and I feel like he has to get past through him, and I wish, wish he is, um, God willing, and next step is to get to those belts. Yeah, what was your thoughts of the Anthony Joshua and uh, Alexander Yuzik fight? It was a good fight, you know, um, I felt like... Usyk did enough to win the fight. He was moving around, touching him up. Even though his punches were not hard and everything, he was just landing more punches out of Joshua. Joshua would land big punches, but just like one or two. And that wasn't enough to win the fight, you know? But I felt like uh, Usyk pulled it off. Yeah, and then obviously Usyk's big fight is against Fury. But, uh, you know, if that doesn't go through, who knows what he's gonna do? But how do you think Andy fares against Usyk if given I the mean, chance? Honestly, it'll be like evenly matched. They're not that far apart in height. They they look like the same size. It'll be a good fight. I yeah. feel like uh, Andy will do enough to beat Usyk. Yeah. What about Fury Usyk? If they if they get in there, it looks like that's they're working on it. But yeah. you know, things I, never things never work out. But for right now, it looks like they're negotiating it for sure. Yeah, I feel like that'll be a good fight too. I feel like Fury would have that. That range on them, that the the long reach, but it'll be a good fight. September fourth, your fighter is in the he's, he's in the ring. Your undercard. Tell us about Anthony Garnica, Andy. Well, he's a coming fighter, man. He's a great fighter, and the main thing is just to keep him busy. You know, he yeah. wants to become champion. He wants to become legendary, and all that happens here inside the gym and in the ring. You know, so. You just gotta train hard, man. Yeah. It took me 29 damn years to get where I want to be at, and that's why I want to take advantage of it, and that's why I try to get them motivated. So anything is possible. Mm -hmm. He's saying that we're gonna see the the uh, like the best version of Andy. Uh, Hopefully, September 4th. man. Like I said, everybody has a plan until they get hit, but <laughs> I'm just gonna do my best, my best out there. <laughs> I just know that I put in the work, so. Yeah. yeah. Just have fun. Got the work in. Last thing, what do you tell to all your supporters, your fans? What do you tell them? Watch me September 4th on the undercard of my boy Andy Reese. Uh, we're going we gonna to throw it down.